How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flames Plays, continuing and install the game. And... Uh-oh. I don't like this. Yep, yeah, I was going to say, this is not a good door. Sighted. Blind. Ooh, okay. We have three minutes. Okay, so I have to actually do one. I'm gonna go blinded just to see what this could be. Okay, it looks like we have a. Yeah, I was gonna say there better be a board at the top of here, or it's gonna just go badly. Oh, 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 oh! I almost fell through. It just dropped down. I'm sure it's safe. Oh my god. Oh, I hate everything about this. This is not good. Oh, whew. I thought that was gonna be, I thought, I thought that was just death. Uh, wow, I did not, I did not like that area. Like super clench mode right there. Uh, nothing, nothing. Oh, these lockers suck. Oh, we got a coupler. I'm assuming we need that for up ahead. Probably. Um, actually there's nothing here? That's actually very weird. I guess I have to go back? Oh, there's the coupler thing. Why would you do this? Why would you go backwards? Tap? This is asking for trouble. I mean, granted, I don't want to see, I don't want to stare death in the face as I approach it, but I also don't want to, like, walk backwards and do it randomly. All right, so we got the coupler. Uh, definitely want to put that one there, that one there. We're going to do that. Uh, that way, we want to twist this, spin it. We want to bop it. Okay, and then we just turn this. There we go. Nailed it. Uh, I guess. Oh, okay. I was going to say. All those doors are just sealed. Uh, flashlight. Oh. Okay. I'll take a... F oh, yeah. The flashlight's way better. And a water bottle. Refreshing. Great. We did it! Yay! Checkpoint. Oh. Hi! Hello, friend. Uh, you appear to have a Venus flytrap style mask on your face. And it's not triggering, which is good, I guess. You probably got the key. I need a key for this. Speaking of key, I need the key for this place. So. I didn't really actually mean to punch there, but sure. You can just punch the stairs if you feel like it. I'm not gonna judge you. Tap. You know, in your current situation, I don't think anyone has the right to judge you. You do what you gotta do. Find a key to open the utility door. Restore power to the security checkpoint gate. I think I'm right now I'm just trying to restore the power. The key will probably come from that. Oh god, not one of these things again. Oh, A is going so quick. A is going too now B is going too quick. Oh, okay. It's a hypo. Got like a bajillion of those. And I'm not low enough on health that I feel like I need to absolutely use it. I have maximum ammonia. That's there. Ooh, stun trap schematics. How does that what does that do? Inventory. Is, how do I oh here we go? Let's see. Schematics that detail how to put together a trap that will stun enemies within a small area. I I've been tapping on it, but it's not actually letting me do anything. So I guess it's fine. Note to the administrators, the patients are beginning to demand a religious area in the asylum where they can pray. Medication to keep them more agreeable is not working. If anything, they are getting worse. If we don't do something about this soon, we can have a full-blown full riot on our hands. If we can take the courtyard area and build a small chapel there, I think they will shut up about it. Nurse Cleaver. I'm sorry, but Nurse Cleaver just sounds like a horror villain right there. Oh, okay. Goddamn mice. I hate that the mice scare you more than most things in this game. Alright, key right there. We can grab it. Got it. Mm -hmm. And we didn't even pass off from the pain. I like how it just, it's pain into death. Like, I don't think you're gonna die from the needles. Like, maybe. I mean, probably. You might, you'll probably die from something on the needles. But regardless, it's gonna stab you. It's not like, oh wait, what's this? Newspaper clipping. Negligence leads to officer's death by Oswald McGillicuddy. If there wasn't a more uh, fake name, I've ever I've never heard of one. 
If it wasn't bad enough that there is a killer out there mashing up taxpayers into tiny itty bits, now we have the cops to worry about too. To his own admission, Detective David Tapp completely disregarded process and went rogue, convincing his partner, Detective Stephen Singh, to join him in an unwarranted entry to catch the Jigsaw Killer. Not only did they break in the Jigsaw's secret hideout without a warrant, but they didn't wait for any backup either, probably hoping to get all the glory for themselves. Well, Jigsaw got the drop on them, slicing Tapp's throat from ear to ear and nailing Singh in the top of the head with a double barrel shotgun. All this was confirmed by witness Jeff Thomas, who was in one of Jigsaw's little traps. He claimed, he claimed Singh saved his neck, but when Tap got sliced and Singh got blasted, good old Jeff was stuck in the trap until help arrived. So that was the guy that was had the drills that were about the drill into his brain. Now that's the manual, we already found that. Uh, from Saul 1. I don't remember his name being Jeff. I don't think they really talked about that though. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I do actually remember his name being Jeff for some reason. I know Jeff was also, oh no, that was Paul. Paul was the guy in the, in the razor wire trap. Hey, we got the store open now. Oh, I forgot about the, the... I just now remembered about the uh, the shotgun traps. And I'm pretty hesitant to cross areas now. How is, how is he electrified? I actually do wonder. Alright, so it looks like from here I gotta find a area where everything lines up properly. So, I need to find one of these that actually works. Uh, I get, I get what it's trying to get me to do. How much time do I got left? Oh, I got 2 minutes and 30 seconds? I'll be fine. Oh, there you go. Maybe? 4, 3... Uh, four, three, maybe, maybe that was it. Oh, workbench guy. Is there anything in here? Nothing. Mm. I'm, I'm, just, I'm about to die in some, in some trap, and I'm just like, oh, what, what collectibles can I find? Uh, it's, it's definitely not it. Now, calm down there, Mister. I think I'm now just looping. Yeah, I am just looping. It's not great. So, I know. Calm down there, Jigsaw. Oh, I can check this out. Ah, I found a nail. Awesome. You know, it's good. It's good to keep a stockpile of things you need. Yeah. So this is definitely the best way to go. Four, three. Oh, it's just four, three, five. I'm look. That five is throwing me off. I wasn't sure if that was actually part of it or not. So four, three, five. Pretty simplistic. Oh, I got time. So I can just check out all this stuff here there's nothing really here to check out so four i went through i could have actually just done this a lot here if i had gone this way four three five hey look at that circuit box unlocked uh that's not great i need to find a conduit this conduit here please tell me the conduit's here oh there you go coupler got it oh, i don't think i actually grabbed it though there you go now i grabbed it I got a minute. Oh, I got stuck in the thing. Okay, now this is actually a little tense because I only have a minute to figure this puzzle out here. Uh, this has to go this way, which means this has to be like this. Oh, and then I can just rotate the middle. Good. Good, good, good. Hey. We're safe. Thanks, buddy, for not electrocuting us, even though I'm actually wondering how he's electric. he was electrified. Oh, you know, maybe it was actually the chain itself was electrified. And then his body was just a conduit. That would make a lot more. Okay, good thing I grabbed all the stuff in there when I had a chance. That would make a lot more sense. So that opened the door up. You, you monster! You killed my husband! You! Your husband was killed by your father. Your father was killed by your father. Defenses I prepared would have easily been disabled by police procedure, but those procedures were ignored. Who do you think ignored them? Tap that son of a bitch. Uh oh. That's not. That's not promising. That sounds like she might have a gun pick with us. 
Now I should be able to press the button here. Yep. Stop locking doors behind me. It's creepy. Uh, I was going to say, this dude is definitely going to start attacking me. Alright, so let him take a swing. I mean... Ooh! Went very slow. <laughs> I went slow motion way early there. Alright, let's do it. Let's watch it. Let's watch it. Let's watch it snap. Nothing on him. Hey! Door sealed. Is there more? Oh wait, what's this? I just noticed there's something here. Detective Steven Singh. Oh, wait. Was he buried here for some reason? Oh, that's a hell type, but we already know that's a thing. I'm very confused. Why would Singh be buried here of of all places? This is an asylum that might have a maybe it has a graveyard attached to it. It's weird. All right, handy dandy flashlight time. Make sure we got no spooky traps around this room. Have you found your god? Ooh. Uh, examine it? Uh, I guess I'm going to. Oh. Okay. Somebody didn't make it out of there alive. Tests of our experimental remote uh, sympathectomy, so I don't think that's a real word, but okay, are going rather well. A traditional surgical sympathectomy requires the surgeon to enter the body cavity and section several ribs to access, access the sympathetic nerve trunk. The, thoriac, the thoriastic nerve cluster is then dissected within the patient. This has been proven to cure the several cases of causalgia. Causalgia, sure, among our patients here. The remote, that word, as we're calling it, uses a device similar to manis, leukotomes, but used to dissect thoriac nerve tissue rather than the brain. The size of the instruments mean the patient is in less physical danger during the procedure. It is very hard to estimate where the nerve tissue is being dissected, leading to some unexpected nerve damage. Okay, that was a lot of words I did not know, and I don't remember them. Aside from thoriacic, th th thoracic, Jurassic. We'll just go, yeah, Jurassic nerve. Ah, crap! I'm walking in glass. And this door's locked. And this door opens. Am I in glass again? Yes, I am. God, this glass is the worst part. No, no, the random. Power is a fickle thing in these old asylums. Alright, so we need to we gotta find another circuit. Okay. A coupler, that's what they're called. I really sorry. I only have He's got a gun. Oh. Well, alright. Guess I don't have to worry about him. There's a mannequin just chilling there. Nothing in the wardrobe. There is another mannequin just chilling there. Where I start stepping around. I should be, I should really be checking the floor for more for glass. Oh boy. I'm going to die from glass. I'm willing to bet at some point. It's a nice uh, outside area, actually. Very nice. Very peaceful. We're probably going to go outside, aren't we? At some point. Uh, X. Aha! Look at me. I'm not dying and all that. I already had that. I already have a flashlight, but alright. Glad I grabbed another one. Stop, stop grabbing the flashlights. That would please me. He says to himself. Okay. Got one of these things. Right, so it has to be this. It has to be that. Mm hmm. And then we just turn that there. Oh, right. We just do that. Nailed it. Open this door. What do we find here? We found a scalpel. Speedy boy weapon. Great. Mannequin usage. Using mannequins as a coupling device for prisoners has not had positive results among the more severely disturbed patients. Oh, We had hoped to use the mannequins as human surrogates to ease the patients back into societal life. The result is that patients are even more distressed and distant than before. Mannequins can still be used in the construction of therapeutic devices for scale, but the rest should be put into storage. Hopefully somebody has a use for them in the future. 
I'm assuming by coupling device they mean more like, you know, human interaction replacement. I'm gonna be honest though, that's not very, really where my mind went. I have a gun now. Okay. Uh, I was hoping to check the dead body, but okay. So, do I have unlimited ammo? I'm, I'm dying. I'm dying. I, I am, I am dying. That's not great. I found the coupler. Uh oh. Oh, this thing. Oh crap, I gotta heal though. I... I can't un... Uh... This isn't good. I'm, I'm, I'm so dead. I found nothing. I found the valve. I'm, yeah. Oh my god. How was I supposed to know I had to... No. Oh. How was I supposed to expect gas? Seriously. Oh, I'm back here now. Right, on the plus side, I know not to step in too much glass. I immediately stepped in glass. That I did. Okay. So we have that dude. He's gonna shoot himself. We know that. Check the stuff though. Uh, Honestly, it's not really worth going into that room then. If all you get is oh god damn it, I keep I gotta stop walking the glass. Just take the revolver, block from the other side. Alright. So I'm gonna health hypo first. Makes way more sense. And then oh no, the gas. Uh valve's still here, good. Now we can fix this. Hopefully. If we work quickly. Okay. Um, this is definitely not the way to go with it. Uh, that's also not the way to go with it. Which means... Wait, how does this work then? How do I... None of this really makes sense. Oh yeah, this one does. And then we just rotate this. Oh god, I'm going to die. Oh. Dude, unfair. So unfair the way this screws me over there like that. Hey, we got the coupler though. Yay. Yip zippity doo da day. Guess I'm gonna use a hypo. I mean, I feel like now is probably the, the best time to possibly be able to use it. We have the coupler. Let's not walk on the glass that we found over here. We're gonna go back this way. And then in here there's a there's a circuit box. Yes. Uh, okay, so we got a- oh, this one's actually easy. And we just rotate this middle one. Moosh! You're in danger of becoming useful, detective. I am? Okay. Push the button. There was a guy there. I saw him. I'm willing to bet that if I fall, I will not fall gracefully to the floor below me. I will just die. Pretty sure that's the case. It's, we already know it's, it's, um, Singh's wife. Nothing there, just fire. Yeah, I probably would have fell through that hole and just crispluted. Alright, that, that door just opened. I'm hearing a lot of noises. Hey, water bottle. I don't think I would trust water found here. Regardless if it's, if it's in a bottle or not. St I still don't, oh god, these things again. Wow, wait. Oh, please stop going so slow, everything. Me? Okay. Why? Oh. Got a hypo back. Good. Good, 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 good. Oh, we're going outside, though, actually. Very nice looking. Uh oh. Oh, fire boy. Where is my crosshair? There we go. And he's down for the count. Already. Gonna be 
honest, I kind of expected that to be a little harder. Also, I pulled the right trigger thinking I would fire. Oh! Oh! I hope you're all enjoying this series, and if you are, let me know in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up, I really do appreciate that. And also make sure you're subscribed to get this release new content or go live while live streaming. And of course, have a great day. Look out for booby traps and remember to burn bright. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.